as well. Yeah, so now let's talk about the uh, vaccine, the inoculation program. It's something that people hope that it will help uh, ease the outbreak situation in Thailand. And we, the government has been criticized for the uh, slow rollout. But now Bangkok just revealed its inoculation plan and it said that it will try to inoculate 70% of the city's population at the rate of 50,000 people per day. That is a lot. And it also said that beside the hospitals in Bangkok, it will set up 14 locations across the city to help with the inoculation program. Bangkok Governor Aswin Kwan Meung said that BMA or the Bangkok Metropolitan Administration has joined force with the Thai Chamber of Commerce to organize the campaign, which those aged over 60 and those with congenital diseases will be a, the priority. They will get inoculated first. The governor said that everyone in Bangkok, including the vulnerable, are covered by the plan. They might, however, consider allocating vaccines to other groups if the inoculation plan does not meet its goal. Most of the 14 locations are shopping centers, community malls, and privately owned buildings which each have the capacity to inoculate 1,000 to 2,000 people per day. These are the 14 locations that were organized by BMA for the inoculation in Bangkok. You can see there are the northern area of Bangkok, southern area, there's the part on the east and the part of the Grung Thonburi area, which is on the east side of Chao Priya River. So they try to make it uh, the inoculation center for each area so people don't cram up all at one place.